Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today we're going to have a little Timu haul. Um, yeah, so I have three little bags, so there probably isn't too much in here, but uh, I just thought we'd go through it kind of quick. And I will leave all the links below to my orders or to the items. Um, so check down in the description box. I'll also leave my, my, uh, affiliate code or now I paid for all of this. I don't, I don't get like free items from Timu, but I have an affiliate code and I don't even really know what it's for, I guess, unless you're like a new user, which I, I don't even know if there's any new users out there at this point. So, <laughs> but anyways, I'll leave the links for everything down below. Um, I do want to talk about Timu Circle sometime in a, maybe like a short or another video to kind of explain that. And also if you're ordering from Timu, don't forget to check your price adjustments like every day because they can regenerate um, on orders that are um, up to 30 days old. So you can get some credit back from there. So don't forget to do those. If you want to know how to do those, let me know. I can maybe do a short or a video on that as well. So yeah, thank you so much for being here. Also, one other last thing. The video before this one, I'm doing a giveaway. It's like a subscriber surprise type of thing because I hit 5k subscribers so I wanted to give back to you guys. I'm going to give away two uh, $50 gift cards to two winners so go back to that video uh, and leave a comment. That'll get you entered to win that. All right. I think that's all that kind of stuff out of the way, right? All right. So let's just get into this and let's see what I got from Timo. All right. Got my spectacles on and I just dropped a bag. All right. Here we go. First bag. Let me empty this out. There's not very much in these bags. I don't know why. It seems like they tend to split up orders sometimes. So I don't know. I'm not sure why they split these up with another with the rest of my other order, but whatever. So here's some of these um, hydrocolloid like acne patches. And of course they put the dang label on the front of it. But they were $1.79 and you get 400 pieces of these patches. And I use these for blemishes all the time they look like this they usually come in different sizes but these are like all the same size and you just if you start to get a pimple put one of these things on at night and by morning it'll pretty much be completely gone i don't know how they work i don't know why they work but they work so if you have like a pimple coming on hurry up and get it on there highly recommend these and yeah you get 400 patches for a dollar 79 so yeah our new our new rescue kitty, Kermit, followed me down here. So if he happens to get up here, I'll I'll introduce you to him. But I don't know. He's kind of like checking, checking stuff out. Okay, then I got this bronze. Or no, I'm sorry. It's called GZE. I thought it said bronze. Tanning cream. True color. Sunless tanning. No damage to your skin. It was $4.98. Um, don't know if it works. But I love um, like a faux tanning cream or gel. So I thought I would try it. You know, that way I don't have to sit out in the sun to... To get bronze and honestly I don't really tan that well anyways I have really uh like fair Irish skin so it doesn't smell bad it's kind of orangey that's my fear with some of these is is it gonna turn me like you know like an orange Timu bag so we will test these out and I will let you know there's no real scent to it which is nice because sometimes the scent of these things is horrible uh, but yeah, it was $4.98 for this one. If I can get the top back on, it is not going to go back on. I want to make sure it's on nice and tight. But yeah, this is what it looks like. GZE Tanning Cream. Um, yeah, I don't, it just says apply evenly an abundant quantity over the entire body and reapply frequently, especially after swimming, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, at least it doesn't stink, so... There's that. And then I got this tanning cream and it says it's coconut. So I don't know if it's coconut scented, but it was $5.98 and it looks like this tanning cream. Uh, Melio sunless tanning, no damage to skin. It says coconut flavor. Like we're going to taste it. No, no, we're not going to do that. But hopefully it smells kind of coconutty, but it looks the same. Nah, it doesn't smell like coconut, okay? Mm-mm doesn't really smell like anything to be honest so I don't know but we're gonna try them out I might try like one on each leg tonight because I'm getting in the shower well maybe not tonight because I want to exfoliate first and give it a real go so I'm gonna try like one on each leg and I'll do before and after pictures or something and then we can kind of see what they look like because tanning creams are like so iffy um, you know, and if I can find a, a better tanning cream that doesn't cost a whole lot of money and save us a few bucks, that's what we're here for, right? 
Okay, so there's only, I think, like, two items in this bag. Um, it came, it's so weird how they separate items. I don't, not real sure why they do that. But I got this as a free gift. It was like some kind of spin the wheel type of deal. Um, so I picked it. It's a, uh, twisted plate, like curling iron. Look at the box. The box is always so jacked up on these things. Um, but yeah, I got it free. So can't beat that, right? Let's pull it out and see what it looks like. Okay, it comes with some hair clips. Um, this is what it looks like. You get two of these black hair clips. And let's see here. There's a little guide for it. But this is what it looks like. It feels really nice. It's actually got a little bit of weight to it. The cord swivels, which is nice. It's black with like a rose gold type of finish or whatever you want to call it. So there's a finish now, like trim. There's a button back here that you click to release it. And so that's what the plates look like. They're like twisted. So I'm assuming that when you like pull your hair through, it like curls it. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, but it is digital. There's an on off button here and then it'll tell you what the temperature is. Uh, so yeah, I got that for free. Don't don't know how. Every once in a while, I'll get those spin the wheel deals um, where you can pick a free gift and then buy four other items at 50% off or whatever. I don't know why I get them or how I get them or when I get them. They just kind of pop up randomly. But yeah, so I got that for free. That's a pretty dang good gift for free right there. So yeah, I will have to read the instruction book and see how to use it. it I, I don't see anything right off the bat that says how how hot it gets it must go up to like 230 because that's the recommended temperature for thick hair on this booklet so maybe that's all the higher it goes up i'm not real sure okay then i think i saw um somebody else get one of these and i can't remember who but it was it was 872 and it is the cleaning blackhead thing that like sucks all the stuff out of your face so i'm like i'm gonna have to try that the cat's into something over there um so yeah, I've, I've never tried one of these before, but I always sometimes feel like my skin could use a better cleansing than I actually give to it by just washing it. So that's kind of why I bought this. And it, for $8.72, it's actually really nice. You get this. There's a recharging cord. I don't know what these little poofs are for. No idea. I guess I'll figure that out. And then you get all these different heads. There's one, two, three, four, five in different sizes so some of them are like wider than the others see what i mean and then other ones are like really tiny so if you really have to get something out of there but yeah you just oh it's actually charged already hear that yeah that's pretty awesome okay let's see it says oily normal or dry skin I can feel that, but I, I'm guessing it probably needs charged up a little bit because it sounds like it's about to go. So I'm going to take that upstairs and charge it and maybe try and use it tonight. And we'll see how that works. I'm not real sure what these are for, so I will read the booklet. Um, maybe this goes down inside it somewhere. I'm not real sure. It doesn't really say what the... They're just like little... They look like little sponges or something. I'm not sure. But it says on here, like, the, the bigger head, the heads are for, like, different things. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, they all do something different. So, like, the oval heads to reduce wrinkles. Um, the mini round head is sensitive skin and blackhead skin. Round head, all skin type. Small round head for sensitive skin. Middle round head for oily skin and sucking the blood, blackheads, I almost said bloodheads, sucking blackheads out. And the big round head is to suck out blackheads and lift the skin. So I don't, I mean, yeah, I've never used one of these before, but I thought, heck, I'm going to try it, you know? I mean, like I said, sometimes I'll like wash my face and I'll even scrub it and exfoliate and I'm just kind of like, mm, I wish, you know, I just, I feel like it could be a lot cleaner, I guess. So yeah, we're going to give that a, give that a go. And then, boy, I'm running through this. This is like, I might have to get another bag because I think this is all greenery and this is going to be like a super short haul. So, or maybe we'll just keep it short. This looks literally like all greenery. So, we shall see. Let me pull it out of here. I think I bought these. I don't know why I bought these. I need to quit buying so much greenery. I can tell you that. 
Yeah, these are like all greenery, so I might grab another bag, but... So I got these two, they're just like, looks like grass, and they are, were $4.34, and you get eight pieces of this. So you get eight pieces of this, and it, it really does look like grass. I mean, how would they know? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, other than the fact that it is like super green, like that is some green grass right there. Um, but yeah, it's just little pieces of grass. I mean, I don't know. They're okay. I'm not sure what my idea was with those. No idea. I'm, I don't have much of a green thumb, so, but they were $4 and you, so for $4.34 you get eight pieces in each one. And then these three things are the same, so I hope I put a price on one of them. Yeah. They were $5.69 each. They're calla lilies. Um, there's eight pieces in each one of these, so eight, eight and eight and I will open one of these um I'm not sure what I was gonna do with these either but I love just putting greenery out in the house and I don't like putting like potted plants in the house because of the, the cats because I just never I'm always afraid they'll like eat something so I don't like to put real plants in the house just for that fear of them like maybe eating something that might kill them <laughs> so uh yeah, and I really like calla lilies, but these are like little tiny little calla lilies. So you get eight pieces, or no, one, two, there's one, two, three, four pieces in one of these bags, and all the calla lilies are falling off. Sorry, the cats are over there playing with each other. It looks like I need to put some back on here, but this is what they look like. They actually look pretty real. I mean, you know, they're, they don't look like super waxy or anything. They have like a pretty decent coloring. Like I wouldn't know these were fake. Probably not. But yeah, these little calla lily things are kind of falling off. So, but yeah, that's what they look like. Um, so yeah, you get eight pieces in a pack. Um, and that was four pieces right there. So I don't know. I probably bought more than I needed to. And I don't know. I, I really want to plant flower, regular flowers outside this year. So I might try and find somewhere to put these inside this year. But I bought a lot of greenery from Timu this year, like a whole lot. So, all right, let me grab another bag since that was so quick. Let me grab another bag and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Let's go through this last little bit here. Um, actually, this is actually like three more bags because they packed like two or three items in a bag. I don't know why they did that, but anywho, I saw these. Um, they're like towel hooks, I guess, but they were $3.79 and they look really antique. Let me let me take them out of the package. Well, I mean, they don't, but from a distance they would maybe, but uh, you get the, they're definitely metal, but there's like, they're like a hook. So you can put like, you know, clothes on it or your towels or whatever. I thought they were really cool. Very cool looking, kind of antique looking, and they give you a screw for it, so you screw them onto the wall, and you can hang whatever you want on them. But they're metal. Um, I think they are. Yeah, they are metal. But they were three seventy nine for two. But I just thought they were really pretty, like very French country, very princess bedroom type of type of look. So if you have a little girl that has like a princess obsession, those would be really cute in her room to like hang up her clothes on. Super cute. Okay, this was eleven forty seven. It says emerald. Eleven forty seven emerald. Oh, the okay. This is a wind chime for outdoor. It's a like a koi fish. Um, our deck. I'm gonna paint it like a dark brown, and then I'm gonna have most of it like this turquoise type of color. They give you the string, which I'll probably have to find another string. There's a, a hole right here, but oh, okay. You gotta pull it out. But it's supposed to be like a wind chime. I don't know how great that is, but mm, okay. But eleven dollars and forty-seven cents. It's not very. Uh, it's not a very soothing wind chime. I'll, I'll say that. But yeah, I thought it was kind of cute. And we're. I love. I love like fish, nature, birds, that kind of thing. So I'm gonna hang it outside somewhere. Even if it looks good out there, that's fine. That's all I really wanted, anyways. And then along the same lines, I saw these. So if you're into like a nautical type of thing. These were $5.57 for two, and they had these in different sizes, and they're just like fish made out of wood with like a net around them, so like really like nautical beach kind of theme, and they're hooked together on this like trim, and they look like this. Aren't they cute? 
Like if you have like a, you know, if you're, if you have like a nautical theme in your bathroom or something, these would be adorable in there or, you know, any, really anything out on your deck or something. I just think they're like super cute. So I'm probably going to put them out on our deck somewhere, but they were, you get both of them where you get, like, I guess they consider this one item, but you could split them up if you wanted to. But yeah, they had these in different sizes as well. Um, then I got oh, this, <laughs> and this is pillows. Um, so I got them in a, it says 45 by 45 centimeter. I'm thinking they're like either 16 by 16 or 18 by 18, but they were 637 for two pillows. Um, so yeah, I'm probably gonna take these upstairs because if you're, hey Kermie, if you, um, I bought some rabbit, like, French country type of pillow covers and my they didn't fit the pillows I have they were like too small so I think they were only for 16 by 16 inch pillows so I'm hoping that's what size these are but I don't know I probably have bought the wrong size because these look pretty daggone big so uh, that sucks but maybe I'll just get different pillows too um, now these are going to take a minute to puff up because when you pull them out um, you know, you got to floof them a little bit, get them kind of floofed out, maybe put them in the dryer for a little bit, but I was just going to use them as decor anyways, but yeah, I think they're bigger than 16 by 16 though. So I don't know. I don't know if they're going to fit in those, in those pillow covers that I bought because I bought the pillow covers in a size 18 by 18. And I know that my pillows upstairs are 18 by 18, but they didn't fit them. So I don't know. That's so much for sizing, right? Okay, I got this. This was... How much was this? So, did I even write a price down on this? Probably not. I don't know. I'll put... Anyway, it'll probably be down below, but it's like a sprayer for, um... You know, bug stuff and weed stuff and all of that. Um, yeah, I don't... I guess I didn't put a price on it. Of course I didn't. Why would I do that? But uh, this top screws off, and you pump it, and it'll spray. And it's got some different nozzles down in here. So I actually kind of had an idea to use this as a cleaning tool to, like, spray cleaning stuff in the shower or around the toilet or something like that. So it has, like, different nozzles you can use with it. There's, like, a really good squirty one, and then, you know, this one I think is more, like, a, for a wide area spray. But yeah, you can just put your like cleaning solution in here or your bug stuff for your yard or your weed stuff for your yard. And then you just pump the top and it'll spray, you know, so you just push this down and it'll spray. So yeah, I bought that for potentially for cleaning solution that I can just spray all over the tub and the toilets and then go back in and clean it up. You know what I mean? It's, I don't know. I don't know why I thought that would be a good idea. I don't know. Who knows? Okay, anyway, next up, I bought these before, and I think I've shown them before, but they're these uh, earring, cross earrings. They were $1.49. I might send these to Brian's mom, because I think I already have a pair of these. But And then I sent a pair to Jessica, simply Jessica Marie, too, and a friend mail. But this is what they look like. They're really, really pretty. Really like those. So, yeah, they were $1.49. 49 very pretty earrings very well made and then I have these solar lights these were 11 or no I'm sorry they were $14.99 and it is a set of how many are in here one two three four maybe six but they're just solar lights I don't really know if that's that good of a price um I like to put a lot of lighting outside and Put, I even put these in flower pots. If you have like a really big flower pot with a lot of flowers, I like to put these in there. Now I know you, these are probably the same stinking ones you can get at Dollar Tree for a buck. How much do you want to bet? How much do you want to bet? Maybe there's more than that in here. Because there's like one, two, there's got to be more. Because there's several of these, unless they're like really tall. Unless you put like a couple of these together. Let's see, one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, there's like ten in here. I swear these are dang near the same as the ones at the Dollar Tree. I mean, very, very close 
to the Dollar Tree ones. And I don't know if you have to pull a... Oh, there's an on button. Okay. There is an on button, so they do light up in there. But they're very, very similar to the ones at Dollar Tree, so... Mm, I mean, you know, I could have went to Dollar Tree and got 10 of theirs. It would probably be about the same price, I guess, because since it's Dollar dollar twenty five tree now but they're not made super well but the again these are probably ones i would probably put in with plants you know like you could even just put the top in with a plant and then it like kind of lights up from underneath it looks really pretty in plants so yeah there's 10 of them in here for 14.99 and i guess that is my last item okay that went pretty quick <laughs> I fly through these halls, don't I? Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being here and for watching my videos and being subscribed. Don't forget to enter my giveaway, my surprise over. Go to the next video over and uh, get yourself entered there to win a $50 gift card, a Visa gift card. And thank you so much for watching. Um, I will try to leave the links. If, I, if you can't find a link, leave a message and I will try and answer your comment with a link. Okay, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!